In this video, we're going to take a look at the only two add-ons that exists for adding vehicles in Blender. And uh, the two are, uh, of course, Traffic Queue and the Transportation add-on. And uh, full disclosure, I have affiliate links, but I get the same rates for both of the add-ons. So I'm not biased in which one you should buy. Okay, so let's first take a look at the uh, Traffic Queue add-on. And uh, this add-on specializes in uh, cars, bicycles, road signs, and traffic lights. In my opinion, the quality and the look of the car models is uh, not as great in this add-on as it is in the uh, transportation add-on. But uh, this add-on also has more bicycles, more classic cars. The uh, traffic queue add-on also has road signs and uh, traffic lights which you not find at all in the uh, transportation add-on. So uh, which one you want to choose, or if you want to uh, have them both, depends on uh, what you need for your scene. And although I really like some of the uh, car models in this add-on, like this car, there are also some really rough models, like uh, this one, as you can see on the textures of the wheels. And uh, these are all of the vehicles that you can find in the add-on, as well as the uh, traffic lights and road signs. And then next we have the uh, transportation add-on, and this is definitely my favorite out of the two. It has more vehicles, the uh, quality of the models is a lot better, in my opinion, and all of the vehicles are also pre-rigged, so that you can get straight to animating the vehicles. And that even includes the uh, planes and the boats. And of course, you have uh, less uh, bicycles. And uh, in some categories, you will find uh, less assets. But um, overall, there are more vehicles to choose from. You do not have the traffic lights and road signs. So if that's important to you, you might have to consider the other add-on. And uh, adding the cars is of course uh, very simple and you also have the option to uh, add the HRIs inside the add-on. The customization of the car paint is also much more powerful with uh, this add-on and you can uh, choose between metallic, matte, shiny and add any color to the uh, car paint. The add-on is also continuously updated so I keep getting new assets into my uh, vehicle library. For example, after uh, I recorded this, I found out that the uh, new update has an air balloon as well, which uh, looks really cool. As you can see, the customization is uh, very simple and you can add it to the cursor or the uh, center of the scene. So overall, this is my favorite add-on for Blender. And uh, these are the vehicles that you can find in the add-on. There are over 50 vehicles. And there you can see the new air balloon, as well as a tram, and uh, many other vehicles that are just added to the add-on. So overall, I would say that if you have to buy one of these two add-ons, that if you really need traffic lights or road signs, go for the traffic you add-on. But if you care the most about the vehicles, you will definitely have a better experience with the transportation add-on, in my opinion. And that's all. Thank you guys for watching and subscribe.